Thanks, Myron. You know, I stand here uh, with our fellow teammates, coaches, uh, student athletes, faculty, staff, and our community, the Notre Dame community, very proud to be here today. Um, I took my leap uh, into this cause uh, when I witnessed uh, the unspeakable violence that I saw, like many of you, and made a commitment that standing on the sidelines was no longer an option. But I, too, like many of you, have had to learn. And so learning comes from listening. And the first group of people that I listened to were the many black leaders that we have in our community here at Notre Dame, and in particular on our football team. And we started by giving them a platform to let them speak. And boy, I couldn't be more proud of the young men on our football team when they use that platform to speak in such an eloquent manner, in such a manner that it moved me even more to be able to learn more and educate myself. Maybe like many of you, I, I did not know what Juneteenth Day was. I had to open up my eyes to learn more about what today meant. And as Father John and Myron have articulated already, we want to rejoice the day. There's no doubt about having that independence. But we also know that the struggles that we still face today, and that's why it's important that when we talked about coming together today, that one of the important elements was the group, the Black Lives Matters, is important to be here today as well because that is the spirit, that is the energy, that is the drive that continues to move change. Because look, it's easy to come out one day and talk about change. It's easy to have one rally. But to keep that change moving, substantial change, it requires a spirit and an energy like no other. And so when we look at real change, it's, it's easy to take a Confederate flag down. We can do that from the office. It's easy to take Quaker Oats, Aunt Jemima off the shelves. That's not what this is about. This is about making substantial change. Better public schools for black men and women. Better health care available to all. Funding for private businesses across the board. This is, this is change that really matters. And black lives matters when it comes to those things. They will celebrate today. It's an Independence Day, but it means much more than that. And that's why this group is here today. That's why this is an important day. We want to rejoice the fact that it's Juneteenth Day. But this means so much more than that. And that's what I've learned. And I'll continue to open my ears and my eyes and continue to educate myself to the real cause that we have to keep championing every single day. So thank you for being here. Thank you for deciding to make a real change. It's a long road ahead, but committing to change and knowing that you have the spirit and you have the energy. And now, I believe, with Black Lives Matter, the conscious of America behind them, you can embrace, like we are today, as one to see that change happen. Thank you.